Hello and welcome. In this video we're going to learn how to add large numbers together. These large numbers can be anything from something like 22 plus 36 or even something big like 5,617 plus 8,200. But to start with, let's try adding 22 plus 36. So, the first step is to set the numbers up so that they can be added. To set them up, you put one number on top of the other. So here we have 22 on top of 36. You want to make sure the columns are lined up. So, 2 and 6 are lined up, and 2 and 3 are lined up right on top of each other. That has to be super clear. Then, you can put this line down the bottom. This line below it is where we write the solution to our problem. And last but not least, you can put a plus sign here which shows that we're adding these two numbers. If this was a minus sign, that would tell us we are subtracting them. Now that we have everything set up, we can add them together. To add the two numbers together, what we do is we add the columns starting from the back. So our first column is 2 and 6. So we add 2 plus 6. 2 plus 6 is 8. We write the solution right below it, keeping all the numbers on top of each other. Next up, our next column, we have 2 and 3. So we work to the front. We add 2 plus 3. That gives us 5. So we write 5 right below that. And we're done. That's our solution. 58. So 22 plus 36 equals 58. Next up, we have a bit of a harder one. We have 6,178 plus 4,296. But we still have the same approach. We line up the columns from the back to the front, all on top of each other very clearly. We have our line, the solution will be here, and we have our plus sign. Now that we have it all set up, we can add. So, we start at the back. We have 8 plus 6. 8 plus 6 is 14. This is a little different. We have two numbers. When we have two numbers, there's an extra step. So I've written it in the columns, keeping the numbers. So the 1 moves to this column now, since there's two numbers here. The 4 will stay the same, but the 1, we actually don't put it down the bottom. We put it right up the top, so it can be added to these before getting to the bottom. This is called carrying. We carry the 1 up to the top, or the first number. We add 14, we carry the first number up and leave the second number at the bottom here. It's still 14, but the 1 is up here. So that's called carrying, it's very important. We'll see it again in this row. So now we have 9 plus 7 plus 1. That's 17. So again, the 1 would be here, but we carry it up to the top. 17. We carry the 1 again. Next up, we have 2 plus 1 plus 1. That's 4. Nothing to carry this time. And our last column, we have 6 plus 4. That's 10. So again, 0, 1. We carry the 1. This time, 1's all by itself. There's nothing above it, so it's like there's a 0. So 1 plus nothing is 1, so the 1 comes down. And that's our solution. 10,474. That was a harder one, so I hope you understood it. We'll look at one more 
of these larger ones. Okay, so this time we have 378 plus 1,241. We line up the columns. You see this number is bigger than this one, so there's nothing here. You can put a zero there if you like, because really you just add the one. But we leave this one empty or put a zero there because there's nothing there. But um, we add it like normal, so 8 plus 1, we get 9, 7 plus 4, that's 11. So 1 comes down, and we carry the 1 up to the top, 11. Now we have 3 plus 2 and the 1, so that's 6. And then we have 1 by itself, or you can go 1 plus 0, and that's 1. So the answer is 1,619. It doesn't matter how big the number is, as long as you line it up, you can add them together. And that's the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions, just put them in the comments. And please consider subscribing to my channel. I hope to see you next time.